safe roads, short commutes and long stretches of scenic drives are things we often take for granted in our Toowoomba region. We enjoy an incredible lifestyle and standard of living and during the 2017-18 financial year, Council invested significantly in key infrastructure to maintain our livability and keep people and freight moving. We spent $143 million on local roads, footpaths and cycleways and looked for new ways to reduce travel times, improve road safety and enhance the reliability of our existing assets. Council worked in partnership with the Queensland Government to deliver projects that will build our region, including continued upgrades to Mort and Boundary Streets to link our local road network with the Toowoomba Second Range Crossing. In the Toowoomba Enterprise Hub, we invested $4.6 million upgrading NAS Road and completed the first stage of the Wairima Cambuya Road rehabilitation and Pierce's Creek Road, north of Crow's Nest. At Council, we recognise that every voice in our region is important. We listened to your feedback and, and invested in projects that will ensure our region continues to thrive. Council's commitment to building a safer, stronger, more resilient region was recognised at the Floodplain Management Australia's Nationwide Excellence Awards with Toowoomba Regional Council named winner of the 2018 NRMA Insurance Flood Risk Management Project of the Year. We will continue to work in this area and have enhanced our flood resilience across the region by developing flood risk management plans for the towns of Yarraman, Kuya, Crow's Nest, John Darien, Oakey, McLagan and Quinlow. This puts us in a position where we can be confident we can be better prepared for future flood events. The Toowoomba Overland Flow Path Study was endorsed by Council in March 2018. This important living document will guide future capital works and ensure more efficient and economically sustainable flood response and recovery arrangements. We have a great team at Council and this year we delivered initiatives and projects that enhance the livability of our community. Thank you to Infrastructure Portfolio Leader Councillor James O'Shea for your support this financial year and to every member of our Infrastructure Services Group at Council. As a team, we have achieved a lot. I look forward to continue working with our community, with government and with local business to maintain our existing infrastructure and to plan and deliver projects that will continue to build and shape our region for the future.